UAG Monarch case for the Galaxy Note 8. You can grab this guy over on Amazon or on eBay or directly from UAG. I'll put links in the description below if you're interested. Urban Armor Gear designed for the Galaxy Note 8. Drop tested approved. 2x military standard on the side. Just more information about the, the case. On this side, same thing. And on the back, some more information. You can pause the video and read that for yourself if you want. Let's open this up. And we are greeted with the case. So I went with the red one because I thought it looked pretty cool. Let's see, pull this out if I can. There you go. Put that to the side. And this is the case itself. First impressions is that this is a nice looking case. Very nice. I like the attention to detail. Look at these little rivets here. Gives that case a nice industrial kind of design. Some branding here, UAG. I like how it's black and not silver on this colorway. You have a honeycomb pattern here on the sides. And on the inside here, this is leather. Feels very good to the touch. Looks nice, man. This design, I don't know, kind of, to me, it kind of looks like an amp or something like that. Now, looking on the inside of the case, you have some more UAG branding here. You have a little bit of a pattern here. And it says there are patents pending made in China. All right, so let's put the case on the phone. Now, this is my black Note 8. Now, this one, I actually have white stone tempered glass, which I have yet to make a video of. So if you're wondering if the UAG Urban Armor case is compatible with white stone dome glass, let's find out right now. I'm praying that it is compatible. Whoops. Put the S Pen back in. Snaps right on. And I'm looking at it right now. And I want to say that it works. Now I'm going to press the corners here. Make sure that there's no lifting. And there is no lifting. Nope. No lifting on the corners. So I want to say that the Urban Armor Gear case, the Monarch series, is compatible with White Stone Dome Glass. Now I'm going to get kind of close here. And it gets really close. Matter of fact, I think it's even... It might actually even be making contact with the screen protector. But it's not lifting it up or anything. I'm going to keep an eye on it. And I'm going to let you guys know if it lifts up or not. But so far, so good. Based on what I'm seeing right now and some of the other videos I've seen on the internet. Yeah, this combination works. Feel in the hand. Feels really good in the hand. The honeycomb pattern here adds a nice grip. Let's check out access to the fingerprint scanner. You have a wide open cutoff, so that should not be a problem. Let's check out the power button. The power button is nice and clicky. Very nice. Now you do have to look for the button a little bit since it's not raised that much, but it has a different pattern so you can easily feel it with your finger. As far as pressing it, nice clicky action, a lot of feedback, very tactile. I like it. Very nice. Now let's do the same thing for the volume rocker. Same thing. Nice and clicky, very tactile, no issues with a volume rocker. And the Bixby button, same thing but who uses Bixby, right? Anyway, let's check out the cutouts on the bottom. Headphone jack, USB Type-C, mic, your speaker, and the cutout for your S Pen. Nice, generous cutout. At the same time, it kind of comes around that corner there a little bit, so if you drop it on this corner, it should be well protected at the same time. Take the pen out. No issues with that whatsoever. Nice. On top, you have a cutout there for your mic, so that's cool. On the back here, nice opening for your cameras, etc. Shouldn't have a problem. With using your cameras or your flash. Ah, the front lip here. Look at that front lip. So if you put this case on in concert with the white stone dome glass, this should protect your phone from almost anything. You lay this down flat on the table, the white stone dome glass will not touch the surface, so you are protected in that regard. So overall, what do I think of this case? I think it's awesome AF, feels good in the hand, provides you with nice protection, buttons are tactile, the fit and finish is great, feels good in the hand. Overall, I am impressed. Very nice. This is a great way to protect your thousand dollar phone. I'm gonna put it on the Orchid Gray Note 8 just to see what it looks like. All right, I'm gonna slide this one in. So if you have an Orchid Gray Note 8 and you buy this case in this colorway, this is how it's gonna look like. You can barely see the Orchid Gray around the camera, right? And there's some contrast here on the bottom. The black and red looks good on the Orchid Gray too. All right, so hit me up in the comments and let me know what you think about this one. Let me know what case you have on your Note 8. Thanks for watching. Peace out.